Hey guys, what's up? It's both your one and only, and man, it's been a long weekend. Uh, I just woke up, so yeah, I just didn't sleep through half of the day. It is like 11, no, it's 12.30 p.m. Jesus, I have been knocked out for quite a while. But yeah, welcome to another episode. What are we going to do today? Uh, we're doing this. And a couple PvP matches. Uh, I don't know if this is good though. Should I run with this team? Hmm. I don't think there's anything I want to change out actually. Well, no, maybe, maybe. Llewellyn? Because I could just buff the rest of the team. But Llewellyn's also DPS. Nah, I'll leave her in there. Ain't really all that important. To be honest, I could max Helios right now. But also, I want to save those uh, Essence for like a trance. Because just going back and just getting all 200 like 50 of those essence is just going to be a chore but I did also change like the stats on like the gears and everything so I should be doing like a lot more damage now at least I should be as you guys can see I'm just stacking debuff that debuffs that's pretty much why I changed everything can't remember who suggested it I think it was Styles who who suggested I change most of my like gear stats but I did and this is the result now so far you're doing like way more damage but yeah I have some pretty bad gear stats I pretty much had like gears with gear set like attack speed and cooldown and that was it I was not even thinking about it I didn't even know those were on the gears and so I actually looked and I was just like, wait, what the hell is all this? <laughs> so I just started changing everything. I'm also getting my gold back as well. That's another thing I've been wanting to do is get all my gold back. It's been like really annoying trying to save up. I also got my allies back as well for the trans, for the next trans that comes out. So I, I can at least have the character max. That's what I gotta say. I don't have it ready for ultimate. So I'm still saving up technically. And Jesus, what? How do we already get here? Alright then, jeez guys. You guys are racking up the score real good right now. Hopefully I can make it to like 10 trillion. Nah, but 10 billion would be nice. Yeah, this is going way better than I thought it would. And this is going past the 3 minute mark. Not bad. As you guys can see, I changed all my gears and everything and we're doing a lot more damage. It's probably mostly Hal that's doing all that damage. Just because I changed his gears. I changed both of Hal's weapons to um, fix damage, I think. Or set amount of damage. Pretty sure it's set amount of damage. So that's what's on both of his swords. I think Landy and Margaret have. Um, what was it? Cooldown uh, damage over time. I think Paladins have attack speed and defense decrease. I'm going to have to look at it after this. I'm not fully sure anymore. <laughs> but we'll definitely take a look at it after. If I can remember this time. I always forget stuff. I don't know how it becomes that easy to forget things. Guess it's just because I'm always in the moment. We're gonna do some um, PvP after this as well. 
Man, you got some of you guys should have been in the last stream. Everybody was freaking out on me just because I wanted to win Lou first before Lucy. Saying it was not like a good idea. It's like not smart, man, not wise. And I'm just sitting here like I'm trying to think about both sides. I need a character that's gonna tie me down in like PvP and PvE. Lucy is not really made for PvP, to be honest. So I'm going for who can tie me over until I can get Lucy for PvE. Right now I'm trying to focus on like all around. Because Winlu is pretty much like one of those all around characters who's pretty much really good in everything, to be honest. That's one of the reasons why I'm going for her. Like, chill out. I will get Lucy, it just won't be like right away. I'll be working on her like as soon as I get uh, Helios to ultimate then you know what I'm gonna put in like the work to get her like geez or you know I probably could you know wait off Helios and just start on her then but you know what we'll, we'll see we'll see what happens <laughs> but yeah I don't think it's really that crucial guys just calm down I'll I'm not saying I won't get her I'm saying she's just gonna be a, like a little bit down the road. To be honest, I'm not trying to go for a full on, yeah, let's beat the whole guild. I'm trying to go for, hey, this is what I want right here and now. And like, I'm ready to actually start PvPing and getting the rubies because you get a crap ton of rubies inside of PvP now. That's the only reason to spark the actual interest for me. So. Yeah. Calm down. I'll get her. Just not, like, right away. Jeez. It's not the end of the world that I don't get her right away. I mean, as long as you guys got her and are doing a crap ton of damage, you guys are good. Me, on the other hand, I am alright. Everybody acted like it was the end of the world. The only thing is, I'm not sure who I want to replace in team for uh, Ultimate Winner. It could be Hal, but at the same time, Hal dished out a crap ton of damage. And no, it's not going to be Llewellyn, just because Llewellyn won't be in the main team. She's still going to be pretty much helper material. If anything, um, I could put one of the characters inside, well, that is inside my team, into a helper. And put Winlu in the main team. Not really sure what I want to go with right now, but I'll think of something. Mainly depends on who does the most damage and ditches out the most. Considering that Winlu will be ultimate, you'll probably think she'll deal more damage now. Especially with her skills, it could be possible. Uh. All right, we made it to ten minutes, guys. Jeez. Not bad. Not a bad run after all. <laughs> oh, nope. Uh, Llewellyn still out. Does howl inside of, uh, you know, world boss. Because she's a world boss monster. That's just pretty much how it goes. I don't think nobody's going to be... I don't think anything's going to be beating her for a while. Wait, I wonder. Recommended heroes. Yep, she's still up there. Hal is pretty low. I mean, there's a reason why she's up here, to be honest, with these guys. Uh, Foxy seems pretty good as up here as well. Oh, uh, what's down here? Of course, this guy will still be relevant with this key. So this key is going to be quite good for a while. I could use it, but, you know, we're not going to. Uh, let's go to PvP. Let's get some matches out of the way. This is random, it. And see how that goes. I'm gonna take this off though. Because I still wanna at least summon whenever I feel like it. And Ultimate Howl is down. The damage I ditch out now is pretty decent, so I can pretty much kill a lot of things. I don't know, Howl should be able to still beat him.
Oh, the howl kind of stopped me from doing things. That sucked. Get on your howl. You did. You did well on that one. You did stop me. Not bad. I guess my howl didn't have time to. Didn't like have a good timing for the three. Which does suck. His three didn't stop the, um, the Kamel. Maybe he used it way too early. That could be a thing too. Can we not have that? Yeah, uh, can we not have her reviving everything? That would be nice. Oh, she's already dead. What? Uh, game? Oh, okay. I had to wait. Thank you. I don't know what went on there. Ah, I hate storm bears. Really hoping we kill him right away. Kind of saw that one coming. Oh, at least he chose to keep the storm bear dead. I just noticed that. All right, next. Let's say we can keep going for like five more minutes on PvP matches. Rip that death passive. Now oh, let's keep going. Who is next? God, freaking bright spark with her like crowd control is annoying as hell. Just constantly stunning you over and over. Man, I really need to get her. I don't know when I want to work on her. But all I know is gonna be real close down the road but first I gotta get um, but first I gotta get Ragnarok to um, ultimate first I think I'm going to be quite busy after this to the point where I won't be able to make like a horror video for the horror channel. Not really sure what's going to go on with that. Hopefully I'll have enough time. If not, I'll just chill for the rest of the day. Just because I don't know when the thing I need to do is going to happen. So I don't want to be like in the middle of recording then the thing actually happens. All right, can we please kill her? Thank you. Oh dear God, we're dead. We're dead. Good, good knowing you guys. Ultimate Hellhawk coming in just to wreck everything. Whoa, what just happened? Wait, do they have a how that just canceled out everything? Cause I didn't see the little, I didn't see Camille like revive anyone. Maybe it was just wrong timing and me getting desperate to kill Hellhawk. Probably a real bad decision. Oh, she has an ultimate. Nah, I ain't winning this one. This one's got a real bad matchup. This is what happens when you auto guys. And auto, you don't have a guarantee of getting like opponents you can beat. But that's also fine, just because it it leads more to like the curiosity of what you're gonna get and go up against. Uh, I should be able to beat this team. 
I should be able to if the game would stop with the shields. I really can't wait for the um, for the uh, trans main characters, just because I want to use Archer to get rid of those annoying shields, like as fast as possible. Just because PvP like this, Jesus, shields just invisibility just ruins all. <laughs> so annoying. All right, goodbye. All right, let's make this our last one. It's actually a good one to go off of. So I got three losses and 12 wins. Oh my God. Can't tell you how much I hate Death Crown in this. Usually, Death Crown, anytime I see a Death Crown party, they normally wreck the hell out of me. Just because of his abilities are really dumb. And it actually depends on how they build him. Doesn't seem like that guy did a really good build. But yeah, we're supposed to be looking at um, allies and their weapons and everything. My bad, I forgot once again. So Margaret has damage over time and a cooldown. This is pretty much what Styles so recommended. So far, it's not half bad. Pretty decent. Oh, okay. It was a uh, cooldown and defense. So yeah, that's pretty much all that's going on there. I don't know what to put on archers though. I just went with the normal attack speed and cooldown. Not sure, I'll figure out something. But yeah guys, hope you all enjoyed. It's pretty much the end of the video. Can't really do anything more unless I was to go back in PvP and you know, but that would literally just be me PvPing for at least an hour. But yeah, let's let's not have that happen. But hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys next time. Till then. Peace out.